Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So what they say in this case is y varies directly with x in both cases. So that means in, the, in these two cases, they both y varies directly with x, meaning their constant is going to be equal. So they give us one y and one x, and they say um, the y varies directly with x, as well as, for this case, when um, y and x. But, this case, but in, this in this one, in this direct variation, we don't know the value of x. But we know that the both y varies directly with x for our same constant. So therefore, we can set them equal to each other. y over x is equal to y over x. All right. So now what we simply do is for one direct variation, plug in our, our values for y and for x, and then set that equal to negative 1, and we want to solve for x. So what we have here is a proportion equal, or I'm sorry, a ratio equal to another ratio, which creates a proportion. To solve for a variable with a proportion, we can simply apply the cross product, where I do 5 times x, which is 5x, is equal to negative 3 times 3, which is positive 3. Now I need to solve for x, so I divide by 5 on both sides, and x equals 3 fifths. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how um, you determine your x when you have two direct variations. Thanks.